in this video we have been given that base of triangle abc is 10 and height of triangle abc is 8 and pqrs is a square then we have to find side length of a square so in any triangle if d base is b and height is h and if pqrs is a square then pq it will be equal to qr it will be equal to rs it will be equal to sp suppose a pq is a qr is a and rs is a and sp is a and now from point a if we draw a perpendicular on bc suppose this point is m and this point is n then m n it will be equal to sp that will be a and a n it is height of d triangle that is h so a m it will be equal to a n minus m n that will be equal to h minus a a m it will be h minus a and now p q r s it is a square so s r it will be parallel to p q that means s r it will be parallel to b c that means these two angles they will be equal and these two angles they will be equal and now in triangle asr and triangle abc we have angle asr is equal to angle abc and angle ars is equal to angle acb so triangle asr it will be similar to triangle abc hence ratio of base sr by bc it will be equal to ratio of height am by an and sr is a by bc is b it is equal to am is h minus a by an is h and if we cross multiply then a h it will be equal to b times h minus a and a h it is equal to b h minus b a and a h plus b a it will be equal to b h and it is a times h plus b is equal to b h so a it will be equal to b h by h plus b so a is equal to 
b times h by b plus h and here suppose side length of a square is a then a will be equal to b times h by b plus h and a is equal to 10 times 8 by 10 plus 8 and a is equal to 80 by 18 and 2 times 40 is 80 and 2 times 9 is 18 so it is 40 by 9.